Hi everyone, welcome to an extraordinary expedition into the captivating world of lunar meteorites found in Defar Oman. Embark on this celestial voyage with me, as we immerse ourselves in the astonishing discoveries that have been made within the ancient landscapes of this Arabian jewel. Disclaimer, this video is for educational purposes only any information and images are based on my research on an article posted online. Oman, a land rich in history and mystique, has become a veritable treasure trove for scientists and space enthusiasts alike. Nestled amidst its deserts and rocky terrains lie extraordinary specimens, remnants of celestial bodies that once graced the surface of our moon. These lunar meteorites, which have made their terrestrial journey all the way to Oman, offer us a unique portal into the captivating mysteries of our lunar companion. Imagine, if you will, the sheer magnitude of these lunar meteorites hurtling through the vast expanse of space, withstanding the extreme temperatures and turbulent cosmic forces. Until fate compelled them to descend upon the sand-swept land of Oman. These fallen fragments have emerged as beacons of curiosity, holding within them the secrets of our moon's geological history. Each lunar meteorite discovered in Oman tells its own remarkable tale, a reflection of volcanic eruptions, rogue impacts, and cataclysmic moonquakes that ravaged the lunar surface millions of years ago. As we delve deeper into the study of these extraterrestrial treasures, we unlock clues about the moon's formation, evolution, and even its complex geologic makeup. Oman, with its vast and largely undisturbed desert landscapes, provides a perfect environment for hunting and retrieving these precious lunar gems. Its arid climate and minimal vegetation offer a unique advantage to meteorite hunters, allowing for easier identification and preservation of these cosmic fragments. But the fascination with lunar meteorites found in Oman doesn't end there. These ancient rocks spark our imagination and ignite our desire to explore further into the cosmos. They transport us to a time and place where humans have yet to set foot, igniting our curiosity about the endless possibilities that lie beyond our home planet. Furthermore, not only do these lunar meteorites captivate the scientific community, but they also beckon collectors and art enthusiasts who seek to own a piece of the celestial realm. The allure of possessing a genuine lunar meteorite, a tangible and tangible connection to the wonders of space, imbues these specimens with a beguiling mystique, making them prized possessions for many. So, join me as we embark on this thrilling expedition into the world of lunar meteorites found in Defar Oman. Together, we shall unveil their untold stories, explore their intriguing composition, and delve into the mysteries of our cosmic neighborhood. Brace yourselves for a journey unparalleled, as we journey through time and space to discover the wonders that lie within these remarkable lunar treasures. Here are the meteorites that were found in Dofar Oman Part 1, let the adventure begin. Number 1. Dofar 025, found. 2000 March 5th. Location. Dofar Oman. Mass. 751 grams, 1 piece. Classification. Lunar meteorite anorthocytic regolith breccia. A brownish-gray stone weighing 751 grams was found in the Dofar region of Oman. Fusion crust absent. Meteorite is a regolith breccia containing numerous mineral fragments and clasts of feldspathic rocks embedded in a glass-rich matrix, Schlieren and vesicles are abundant. Dofar 025 is an anorthocytic regolith breccia. The mineral chemistry of most rock and melt clasts have compositions intermediate between FAN and HMS fields, indicative of a non-Apollo fan-rich locale, possibly the lunar far side. The chemistry of crystalline impact melt clasts within lunar highlands meteorite Dofar 025 indicate that they are derived from Crete-poor, basalt-free areas, making them good targets for age dating to further constrain the bombardment history of the moon. Specimens. Type specimen, 102 grams plus two thin sections, Vernag, main mass with anonymous finder. Number 2. Dofar 026. Location. Oman. Found. 2000 March 6. Mass. 148 grams. Classification. Lunar meteorite anorthocytic crystalline melt breccia. A brownish-gray stone weighing 148 grams was found in the Dofar region of Oman. Mineralogy and Classification M. Nazarov and M. Ivanova. Vernod fusion crust absent. Meteorite is a class poor, anorthocytic. 
crystalline melt breccia containing rare mineral fragments and clasts of feldspathic rocks embedded in a completely devitrified fine-grained matrix. Vesicles are abundant. Sphere-shaped, chondrule-like inclusions and rare impact melt veins are present. Number 3. Dofar 081. Location. Oman. Found. 1999 November 29. Mass. 174 grams, 1 piece. Lunar meteorite feldspathic fragmental breccia. A brownish-gray stone of 174 grams covered by fusion crust was found in the Dofar region of Oman. Classification and Description A. Breccia. MNB, a feldspathic fragmental breccia consisting of clasts of various lithologies embedded into a devitrified fine-grained matrix. Schlieren and vesicles are abundant. Augites are more abundant than Ca4 pyroxenes and often contain pigeonite exolution lamellae. Accessory phases are feiny metal, ilmenite, and T-crossing rich spinel. Crystalline fragments include large gabroic anorthosites, hyal highland basalts, microporphyritic impact melt breccias, dark fine-grained impact melt breccias, and large cataclastic feldspar. No regolith components, e.g., glass spherules, have been identified. Low bulk concentrations of MGO and FEO reflect low abundance of mafic components. Specimens 19.8 grams plus two thin sections, MNB, several grams, moon, main mass with anonymous finder. Number 4. Dofar 280, location, Oman, found, 2001 April 1st, mass, 251.2 grams, one piece. Classification, lunar meteorite anorthocytic fragmental breccia. A gray stone weighing 251.2 grams was found in the Dofar region of Oman. Classification and Mineralogy M. Nazarov, Bernard Fusion Crust Present. Meteorite is a clast-rich fragmental breccia containing numerous mineral fragments and clasts of feldspathic rocks embedded in a glass-rich matrix. Schlieren and vesicles are abundant. Feldspar, pyroxene and olivine. Accessory minerals are T-rich chromite, ilmenite, troilite, and feiny metal. Terrestrial weathering not significant. Dofar 081 and Dofar 280 are probably paired because the stones were found close to one another and are similar in texture and mineral chemistry. Specimens. Type specimen, 50 grams plus 2 sections, Vernod, main mass with anonymous finder. Number 5. Dofar 287. Location. Oman. Found. 2001 January 14. Mass. 154 grams, one piece. Classification. Lunar meteorite, low T, olivine pyroxene mare basalt breccia. History. A dark gray, 154 grams black stone without fusion crust was found in the Dofar region of Oman, 400 meters from Dofar 025. Classification and mineralogy. Contains two adjacent lithologies, mare basalt 95 volume percent, and regolith breccia 5 volume percent. Basaltic portion. Consists of olivine and minor augite phenocrysts up to 1 mm set in a subophytic, fine-grained ground mass composed of plagioclase and pyroxene, with accessory pyroxferolite, k feldspar, apatite, ilmenite, T-rich chromite, ulvospinol, batalite, silica, tranquility ITE, troilite, feiny metal, and a phyolite plus K-rich glass mesostasis, shock veins and impact melt pockets are present. Specimens. 32 grams and two thin sections, Vernog, main mass width. Anonymous finder, number 6, Dofar 301, location, Oman, found, 2001 April 13, mass, 9 grams, 1 piece, classification, lunar meteorite anorthocytic impact melt breccia, a brownish gray stone weighing 9 grams was found in the Dofar region, Oman. Mineralogy and classification, Fusion crust is absent, meteorite is a clast-rich impact melt breccia containing numerous mineral fragments and lithic clasts embedded in a very fine-grained impact melt matrix. The lithic clast population is dominated by impact melt breccias, primary igneous rocks and granulites of mostly anorthocytic and gabbro noritic compositions are rare. Mare basalt material is possibly present. Feldspar, orthopyroxene, clinopyroxene, olivine, accessory minerals are T-rich chromite, ilmenite, troilite, and fenny metal. The meteorite is moderately weathered. Gypsum, calcite, celestite, barite, and fe hydroxides occur in cracks and holes. 
Dofar 025 and Dofar 301 are possibly paired because the stones were found nearby, and they are similar in texture and mineral chemistry. Specimens Type specimen, 1.8 grams plus a thin section, main mass with anonymous finder. Number 7. Dofar 302. Location. Oman. Found 2001 June 28. Mass. 3.83 grams, 1 piece. Classification. Lunar meteorite anorthosytic impact melt breccia. A dark gray stone weighing 3.83 grams was found in the Dofar region of Oman. Mineralogy and classification. Fusion crust is absent. Meteorite is a clast-rich impact melt breccia. Mineral fragments and lithic clasts are set within a poorly crystallized impact melt glassy matrix. Impact melt breccias are most abundant in the lithic class population. Fragments of primary igneous rocks and granulites of anorthosite, gabbro and tropolitic compositions are common. Rare glass fragments of creep composition were found. Mare basalt material is probably present. Feldspar, orthopyroxene, clinopyroxene, accessory minerals are T-rich chromite, Mg alspinel, ilmenite, batalite, silica, tranquility ite, troilite, and fenny metal. Terrestrial weathering is not significant. Dofar 302 and Dofar 081 280 were found nearby and are possibly paired. However, Dofar 302 seems to be poorer in glass and richer in igneous and granulitic lithologies. Specimens Type specimen 0.8 grams plus a thin section, Vernag. Main mass with anonymous finder. Number 8. Dofar 303. Location. Oman. Found. 2001 June 28. Mass. 4.15 grams, 1 piece. Lunar meteorite anorthosytic impact melt conglomerate. A light gray stone weighting 4.15 grams was found in the Dofar region of Oman. Mineralogy and classification. Fusion crust is absent. Meteorite has a typical conglomerate texture. Rounded lithic clasts are cemented by a very fine-grained impact melt matrix. Clasts of impact melt breccias are most abundant and show commonly breccia in breccia textures. Primary igneous rocks and granulites are rare and have mainly anorthosytic and troctolytic compositions. Feldspar, orthopyroxene, clinopyroxene, olivine, accessory minerals are T-rich chromite, ilmenite, al-crossing Zr-rich armalkylite, rutile, troilite, and fenny metal. The stone is moderately weathered, celestite, barite, gypsum, calcite and fey hydroxides are present. The conglomerate texture and degree of weathering distinguish Dofar 303 from Dofar 302 and Dofar 081, 280, which were found nearby. However the meteorites may be paired. Specimens. Type specimen, 0.85 grams plus a thin section, Vernag, main mass with anonymous finder. Number 9. Dofar 304. Location. Oman. Found. 2001 April 13. Mass. 10 grams, 1 piece. Classification. Lunar meteorite anorthosytic impact melt breccia. A brownish-gray stone weighing 10 grams was found in the Dofar region, Oman. Mineralogy and classification. Fusion crust is absent. Meteorite is a class-rich impact melt breccia. Mineral fragments and lithic clasts are embedded in a very fine-grained impact melt matrix. The lithic clast population is dominated by impact melt breccias, possible igneous rocks and granulites of mostly anorthosytic and gabbro noritic compositions are rare. Mineral compositions are Feldspar L. Orthopyroxene Clinopyroxene Olivine Accessory minerals are T-rich chromite, Cr pleonast, ilmenite, troilite, and fenny metal. The meteorite is moderately weathered. Gypsum, calcite, celestite, barite, and fey hydroxides occur in cracks and holes. Dofar 304 is possibly paired with Dofar 025 and Dofar 301 because the stones were found nearby, and they are similar in texture, mineral chemistry and degree of weathering. Specimens. Type specimens of 2 grams, and a thin section, Vernag, main mass with anonymous finder. Number 10. Dofar 305. Location. Oman. Found. 2001 June 28. Mass. 34.11 grams, 1 piece. Classification. Lunar meteorite anorthosytic impact melt breccia. A light gray stone weighing 34.11 grams was found in the Dofar region of Oman. Mineralogy and classification. 
Fusion crust is absent. The meteorite is an impact melt breccia consisting of mineral fragments and lithic clasts set within fine grain, well-crystallized impact melt matrix. Clasts of impact melt breccias are most common. Granulites and possible igneous rocks are rare and have mainly anorthositic and troctolitic compositions. Orthopyroxenite clasts are present. Feldspar. Orthopyroxene. Clinopyroxene. Olivine. Accessory minerals are T-rich chromite, CR pleonast, ilmenite, armalkylite, troilite, and fenny metal. The stone is moderately weathered. Dofar 305 is close to Dofar 303, which was found nearby, in degree of weathering, mineral chemistry, and matrix composition. The meteorites may be paired but they are very different in texture. Pairing with Dofar 081, 280, 302, 306 and 307 is also possible. Specimens. Type specimens of 7 grams, and a thin section, main mass with anonymous finder. In conclusion, the discovery of lunar meteorites in Dofar, Oman serves as a remarkable testament to the enduring mysteries and wonders of our universe. The immense importance of these extraterrestrial findings cannot be overstated, as they provide profound insights into the moon's geological history and shed light on our own planet's past. These lunar treasures serve as a constant reminder of the extraordinary wonders that lie beyond our own planet. They are a testament to the tireless efforts of astronomers, geologists, and scientists who dedicate their lives to unraveling the mysteries of space. The discovery in Dofar, Oman strengthens our resolve to continue searching, exploring, and probing the depths of the cosmos. As we move forward, let us cherish the significance of these lunar meteorites found in Dofar, Oman. They remind us of our boundless curiosity and our eternal quest for knowledge. They serve as a catalyst for our collective imagination, sparking awe and wonder about the vastness of our cosmos. In closing, the significance of finding lunar meteorites in Dofar, Oman cannot be overstated. They remind us of our constant journey to grasp the mysteries of the universe and inspire us to reach for the stars. Let us continue to marvel at these celestial treasures, for they connect us to a world beyond our own and propel us towards new frontiers of exploration and understanding. Thank you for watching. Please like share and subscribe to my YouTube channel for more videos like this.